Hello there, this is Carlo. Welcome to another another very, very quick uh, uh, tutorial. And this is uh, very requested uh, on my channel, so I'm just going to quickly do it now. It's basically how to install Element 3D models. So when you open up uh, Element 3D, that they're, they're in the Element 3D uh, program. So um, I'm going to give you an example of this. Uh, I haven't got this pack yet. I had it a while ago, but I'm going to download it now off the Video Copilot website. And it's obviously the futuristic pack, so I'm going to hit download. Um, and then I'm going to download this pack. Uh, what I'll do is I'll just speed that up for you guys um, so you don't have to watch the download process and um, we'll go from there. pack is nearly downloaded as you can see eight seven eight seconds to go six five four three two one bada bing bada bosh bada bing okay so uh, this will work for mac as well as pc this is the same same um idea it works the same so i'm just going to drag that onto my desktop i'm going to shrink this up and i've got my um zip file so what i'm going to do is because I'm copying that to my pack at the moment. This will normally appear in your downloads folder. So go to your downloads folder and then unzip it. So I'm just going to unzip the pack now. And while that's unzipping, we're going to go, if you're on a Mac, to Macintosh uh, documents. If you're on a PC, just go to your documents and you'll have a video copilot folder here. Open up video copilot folder and then you've got a models pack here. Do not place it in materials, do not place it in bevels. So if I open up my models pack here, you can see these are all the model packs that I own for Video Copilot. So once that's done, we are going to simply drag the futuristic unzip pack into our models pack. And that's it. So now when we open up After Effects, we go to the layer. I'm going to create a new composition, hit OK. And let's go to layer, new solid, just so we can add our uh, element 3D layer. Effects, you know, co pilot element 3D. And uh, we'll go to load, set up. And here I should have the futuristic pack. And that's as simple as that. That's basically how you add your 3D packs to Element 3D. Now, some of them are in st installers, like British uh, Jet Stripe, Metropolitan, Motion Design, so on and so on. They are simple installers, so once you install them, they should install straight to Element 3D anyway. But if it's a downloaded pack, for instance, like Futuristic Buildings or the Star Pack, you just basically drag, um, download and unzip them, drag them and drop them into your documents folder. So as always guys, thanks for listening. Please remember to hit that like button and I'll definitely catch you in the next video.